we have sight, we have, we have speech, we have hearing, we have touch, but scent is powerful. Hi, I'm here at the Perfume Shop Love Perfume Awards, and everyone here tonight has a sweet smell of success. Let's go meet them. Gorgeous Emma, the base of Channel 5 News. Thank you. How are we? I'm very well. I've literally just come off air and I thought I'd come and enjoy a glass of champagne with you, well, Lizzie. Now, do you love a perfume? And do you know what I love doing? I have a little bag-sized perfume in my bag, always. So when I'm feeling a bit down or tired, I give myself a little spray. It helps. I know. What makes a great perfume? How do you know when one is a winner? You're looking for a great smell, obviously. Great name, great bottle, great packaging. A bit like a man, it's the whole mix. But they're hard to find sometimes, aren't they? Uh, <laughs> everyone thinks you're so handsome and all the girls love you. Is there something you could do, like your own moisturiser, haircare, anything? Well, who, who knows? Maybe. Might, 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 something might be coming out soon, you never know. Oh, really? Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, I don't hear much no, about yeah. winning. Well, hopefully, hopefully one day, yeah. Is that you like to do, yeah? Yeah. Oh, you're looking good. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't feel too good. I've put a little bit of weight recently, but you know, oh well. You've been losing so much weight though. No, I lost a lot when I ran the marathon, but slowly putting it back on. But hopefully I'll get back to my healthy self soon. Now, are your shops going from strength to strength? You've got yeah. the shoes? I've, I've literally opened my second shop. So I've got Harry's World and Harry's World Boutique now. You've got, to come, you've got to come down and get a dress. I have to come and get a dress. You've got to come down and get a dress. I'll, be, I'll pick the perfect one for you. Now, are you in competition with Amy? Because obviously she's doing the clothes down the road. Is it? Is it quite competitive? Do you know what? It's not competitive at all. I mean, we're all happy for each other. Sid, you've been amazing. I mean, what is it like being on Strictly? Oh, I love it. Love it. It's the best thing I've done for years. Really? Yeah. But what are the nerves like? You know, a live show, Saturday we're, night. We try not to talk about them or right. think about them. We leave the nerves out of it. And you're very happy with your dancing partner. How are you finding it? Ola, yeah, she's very good. She's hard work. But then I need that, you know, having ADHD and all that. So I need to be whipped into shape. What happens after Tammy, though? Would you like to do a similar thing to your own show? Because do... you're uh, a singer as well, you sing. I think, like, um, Tawi's an amazing stepping stone for everyone to achieve things in life and do different things. I don't know if my uh, future might be in television, but I definitely think that um, with the right training, over the next year I'm doing a lot of like musical theatre workshops and courses. Hopefully I'll be in the, in the West End maybe next year. Do you think that people always think of you as Harry from TOWIE or...? Um, half and half. Some people see me as, oh my god, it's Harry Durbage. Or some people go, oh my god, it's Harry from Nella Rose Essex. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. But you created Shut up. I created it. I should be a legend in my own right. <laughs> Love life good? Yeah, man. It's all good. Yeah. Oh, it's all good, isn't it? You're Everything's very happy. good for me right now. Everything. <laughs> so, like, I'm living the dream. See you later.